Hello everybody, how are we all doing? Who is excited for the Portuguese save? I cannot wait. Uh, say hello in the chat and you've all been saying hello. There's a lot of Portuguese here it seems. I want to go to Portugal, yes. It's all, I, obviously I need to start the save. I haven't started the save, I do like to do that on stream. Um, so yeah, how are we all doing? Why just leave the other, another save unfinished so annoying? This, I did see you writing in the chat, the save is not finished. I am... I, well, I've not been laid off, but I'm, um, yeah, of course, I'm self-isolating. I'm not working, so there's going to be probably, to be honest with you, there's probably going to be five, six-hour streams every single day, and it's going to be Farsley, and it's going to be Balensis. I need something new. Why, obviously, I'm off work, so, so yeah, we, we're going to crack on. Uh, you will have all the Portuguese community watching this. Nice. So, yeah, I mean, we might even do Farsley tomorrow. The Farsley save has not finished. I said it wouldn't finish. Um, so, yeah, that's that's kind of the plan. So, I just want another save. Like, I don't see anything wrong with that. Like, if you don't want to watch Portugal, you don't have to. If you just want to watch Farsley, you can just watch Farsley. It's, it's completely up to you guys. But without further ado, let's crack on because it's going to take me a while to set up the save. Um... So, of course, I've, I've, got, I don't think I've got any mods here, so all the information for this save, if you want to do this save, this is from FM Portugal. Um, so it's, it's the FM Portugal community. It's on their Discord channel. I, I think it was, I forgot his name. But if you go to our Discord... I have set up a, a a channel just for this save, so yeah, it's got all the databases, it's got all the, you know, all the stuff. We stream on Twitch. No, I used to stream on Twitch, but it's more, um, yeah, it's all, all about all about YouTube now. In retail, but self isolate. Yeah, I work in a hotel, and the hotel closed for three weeks, so I. Yeah, I'm just getting paid 80% of my wages. <laughs> um, which is, I mean, it's good, but it's, you know, I'm bored already, and I've been off work for one day, so. You're going to start on the last division. You'll see where we start. Yes, you'll, you'll see. We're just going to set the save up first. Uh, any questions you want to ask about the save, the aims, why the game's setting up, we'll, we'll go through all that. Uh, Farsley save will continue. Do not worry. I'm going to be doing Farsley pretty much twice a week, three times a week. This is going to be three times a week. So you, you really don't need to worry. I don't know why it's not loading my game database though. What are the settings? I'm going to go into that now for some reason. It's not, that's a good start. <laughs> For some reason, it's been when it's been loading game databases, it's been taking a while for some reason. FM will fix the boredom. Can you please just sum up the save? Well, I've not started it yet. Um, I'm going to give you a little bit of... Um, okay, so I have to get the story right. I'm also try I've been trying to pronounce <laughs> this team name for about two days. Portuguese people might be able to help me out. I think I'm quite close. Billy Nasus. That's kind of okay, yeah? That's not bad. I've been practicing. People do slate me because of my pronunciation, so... Billy Nasus. I'm going to go with that. Okay, so if you if you are going to do... We've got a lot of people doing this save. Um, so, so I would recommend, like, this database option, which I use. Um, it's on the Steam Workshop, so you, you can use it. Um, you just subscribe to it on, on, on Steam. And obviously, we're not going to be playing in England. Well, this is the settings that I use, um, and obviously you, you, you'll see me advance right here. Uh, I've got all the players loaded, you can see, from every continent, which is 371,000. But of course, that's for England, so make sure you put England on view only. And then we're going to go down to Portugal. Make sure it's at the bottom. And obviously playable, and then that's all, all fine. We're going to start, of course there so the reason i like to start um the saves on stream is just so you can see there's no other editor data is added and stuff like that um and start from the off basically 
Uh, oh, here we go. Belenensis. Belenensis? Oh, it's kind of close. Belenensis. Okay, okay. I thought it was Belenensis. Yeah, I, I thought that was fine. Anyway, I, I, let, let's tell you the story first. The reason why I've picked these, shall we? So, a lot of you know, because you've been obviously you're in our Discord channel. A lot of you don't know. The reason I've picked these, they've got a really incredible story behind them. So, there is two clubs in Portugal. Um, Billy Nasus, OS Billy Nasus, and I think Billy Nasus CAD. So, in terms of... So, the club that we're managing, I've gone to amateur. Um, they're in, like, the 4 4 fifth tier. Whereas two years ago, they was playing in the Premier League. We're just going to call it the Premier League. Um, and there was a dispute between ownership of the club. So the club split. And one club stayed in the Premier League, while the other club went down into the Amateur Leagues. And But the team that went down into the Amateur League kept the logo and kept the fans. Whereas the team in the top league, they lost. They didn't have any fans. Oh, SAD. Okay, SAD. Yes, never mind, SAD. Okay, but that, that's kind of the story. So, obviously, we're taking over the team in the in the amateur. He was in the 50, I think it is. Um, and the aim is to try and get back to the Premier League, win the Champions League, and be basically become a better club than, um, than Billy Nasus SAD. <laughs> Sad. Yeah, okay. That's fine. You, you, we'll get into it. Uh, Matthias, how you doing? Mathis, how you doing? Similar to MK and Wimbledon over here? Kind of, yeah, I guess. I don't know the full story, so there's some Portuguese people in the chat who might be able to give you the full story. I did read an article on it, and it, it just, yeah, I mean, the club itself, I mean, it should be quite an easy few years to get into the Premier League, I think, because you've got a two-star rep, and your attendances are really high, because obviously you took all the fans from the team in the Premier League, basically. Um, so yeah, I mean, it's going to be really interesting and it's a club with identity that I want to redefine, which is why it's called redefining identity. Um, so yeah, I mean, it's, it, it really is going to be interesting. And I, I, I have a feeling judging by the Portuguese people in the chat that they don't like the team that's in the top, the, the, the Premier League. Um, but yeah, I, I don't know the full ins and outs, but that's kind of the story. Uh, Mikael Moldy, how you doing, man? The attendance with pants for the friendlies. Sad equals MK Dons, but worse. Yeah, so you know how people don't like MK Dons over here. Please go manage the fifth tier, Balenses. I am. That's what we're doing. <laughs> Matthew, you're the biggest troll in the world. Do you ever get bored? <laughs> I don't think you do, do you? But yeah, we, like I say, we, it's going to take a few more minutes for it to load up. Um, and, and yeah, we're just going to... We're going to go from here, I think. I have a cheese scout for you if you will join. Yeah, I mean... Like I say, hopefully we should go through the leagues quite quickly, I'm going to say. So, who's still working out of you guys in the chat? Is anyone self-isolating? Let me know. What you all... What, is anyone else bored like me, apart from FM? Um, my grandfather is a Billionaces triad fan, and he hates the team in the Premier League. So, yeah, in terms of the streams as well... Um, they aren't, they're not going to be 6pm. Um, so the streams going from tomorrow will be about 3pm or 4pm. I, I don't see the need of streaming quite late. So, you know, there's going to be streams where we're going to do four, five, six hours of stream. Um, especially going forwards while I'm off. So there's gonna, tonight it's only going to be like an intro of the save and stuff like that. Um, probably two hours tonight. But, I mean, mainly the next, the next every day is going to be probably four or five hour streams. So... 
Um, there's, there's plenty of time, boys, to play FM and try and keep you entertained. You're going with a different tactic? Yes, I've got two new tactics. Uh, one of them you've seen in the Wheel of Fortune, the other one's slightly different. Which I think Vish might like. I'm probably going to go with the Shadow Striker. Uh, yes, Vasco, that's fine. I'm working. Working from home, basically go only going to the shops. Our oh, chat's going so fast. Uh, Kev, what's going on, man? We're going to see the Shadow Strike here. Maybe. It's nearly set up now. It takes a while to sell, but you guys know. Um, like, the save after this is fast, so. Love the Wheel of Fortune. Yeah, I'm just waiting to see really what Mug's doing, and then... We'll carry on with the Wheel of Fortune. Mug's still working at the moment, so... That plans to come back at some point this week as well. <laughs> I've got nothing to do. <laughs> uh, I've never had three week off work. In ten years of working. So, and I'm on day one and I already kind of want to go back to work. <laughs> so, yeah. I guess there's plenty of time for Football Manager, boys. And I'm sure you guys are doing the same. Yeah, no, it might be worse than like, longer than three weeks. Holmes, what's going on, mum? Uh, we restart our canteen. The fours save. So now there's 140 of you here. The fours they save, as I've said, is not finishing. So, you know, three times a week we might be doing Farsley, three times a week we might be doing this. So, the, the Farsley save has not ended. I've still got things I want to do on that save. And I said I wasn't going to end it, so... I don't know if you know, but the team that you're going to manage actually kept the under-19s from Billy and Aces Sadar. Really? Oh, wow. Okay, we. Uh, I need to change that profile. Can I change? I, I don't want any badges or anything. Okay. We need to sort out... This stream is going to be about sorting out all the responsibilities and stuff like that, I think. Okay, so we are going to go, of course... So, <laughs> it looks so strange seeing, like, Billy Nasus there. So this is the team that we absolutely hate. Like, we are not friends with these. This is the team that we want to replace. And that's the aim of this save, is to become kind of bigger than them, I guess. I mean, the, I mean, you can see, let's, let's go on to these firstly. So they was founded in 2018, which is, you know, yeah, which is what happens when they, when they made the split, I guess. I wonder if I'm in their um, in, uh, fierce rivals. Yes, there we go. So that we are fierce rivals with them, which is amazing. Um, but yeah, this is, a, this is why they've got a new badge, like... It's so weird because when we was doing Madeira, like we would have played against Billy Nesis, like before they split, if that makes sense. Um, okay, so we're gonna obviously. So we're in this league, I think. So we're in Group Two. So this is where we are. Um, so of course they have gone to amateur. Um, but I mean, when you look at the club, like we should kind of go, you know. We should get through the leagues. Look at our stadium. What was the stadium of the, the new team then? I'm still doing research kind of thing. 37,000. That's a big... St so did these take the original stadium? Hang on. I'm getting confused here. So what stadium? Uh, no, maybe they're renting. Oh, they have the national. Yeah, they have the. They they be renting the national stadium. Okay, that's fine. But we've obviously kept the stadium. So, yeah, it's um. Of course, we're amateur. Let's go on to the team, shall we? So th this is our team. Um, two star rep. Of course, when we go into the into the general, you can kind of see a few things. They've still got all the legends, you know, all the icons. Um, we've got some derbies, you know, we've got some obviously the fierce rival. Um, but yeah, in terms of the facilities, though, I mean, we can't really complain. We've got really, really good facilities, like 
Great training, great youth, good youth recruitment at this level. I don't even know what tier we're in. We're starting this save. I have literally no idea what tier we're in. If we're in the fourth tier, if we're in the fifth tier. I, honestly, I don't know. I just know we're in somewhere, group two of something in Lisbon. I'm assuming this is all one tier, right? Maybe. I I'm not sure. I'm not going to go into it too much, but I, I know we're there. So we're going to start the save. Uh, so Billy and Asus. And yeah, that's that's kind of a little bit of bad. So of course, we're going to have no badges. Um, yeah, we're just going to leave this kind of like this, I guess. We don't need badges. We'll try and do that ourselves. Ristello is the true. I'm 74 years old. Am I really? Are you trolling me here? Where do you even put your date of birth in? Why, where's my date of birth? Oh, there we go. Oh, yeah, I'm 74. Jeez. Okay. There we go. Let's put my proper birthday. It's my birthday soon, boys. Are we thinking about a birthday stream on Saturday? What are you saying? 12 hour stream. What are you saying? For a birthday stream. Okay. So let's let's take over these. Can a normal laptop i5 use total of 10 leagues? Thank you for the donation, by the way. And yes, I, I believe it can. I mean, I've got an i7, so... 24-hour birthday stream? Nah, not 24 hours. Have I just pressed OK? I think I have. 16-hour <laughs> stream. Hong Kong dollar donation, respect. I have no idea what it is, to be honest. Well, thank you very much. I mean, there's no football on Saturday, right? So let, let's let's use this as football. Okay. So we have taken over. I'm 30. So where you are is 2, 3, 20. <laughs> I probably do, to be fair. <laughs> let's not go there. Okay, so we've just gone through all this. So you can see we was found in 1919 as well. Mathis, are you getting on on your... Um... A Swedish save. Okay, so let's have a little look at the club vision, shall we? Um, so they want us to get promotion by winning the league, and that's about it, really. And grow the club's reputation. I mean, I'm not sure how we're supposed to do that by winning an amateur league as an amateur club, but you know. Um, yeah, I mean, they've, to be fair, they've got some. They're quite ambitious. I mean, so they should be, really, based on the, the, the facilities, I guess. Right, I've got to sort the responsibilities out first because it annoys me so much. So I've got two tactics I want to... um. I know which one Vicious is going to want. Um, it's one I've been using in an offline save. And it's um, it's interesting, to say the least. It's okay, it's not it's not game breaker or anything like that. But it's it's, it's kind of fun. Of course, you've seen the 4-2-3-1. The I might go with that with the Shadow Striker. Because uh, it did quite, it did alright in the Wheel of Fortune. That was the first time we tried it and it, it was alright, to be fair. Well, first things first, let's have a little look how much we've got in the bank. So we've got 32k in the bank, which is, oh, we've got no transfer budget and we've got no wage budget. Of course, we're amateur. Um, if we look at our team, so for some reason, we have a player on £1,400 a week uh, who is on loan from Kievo. So that's going to be interesting. Um... I mean, generally, like I say, generally the rest are amateur. We've got another one there on loan as well. I don't really plan on, on loaning. I don't think there's any rules in this either. So you can... I, I know there's a rules in like the second tier, I think, where you've got to have mainly Portuguese team players off the top of my head, but or from, from last time we was here, but I don't think there's really any rules for this. You can see there's like no competition rules or anything. Um, I don't think, anyway... 
But that's kind of all there is. You can't loan. Okay. That's fine. We're not probably. I don't really plan on loan. We can get lots and lots of amateur players. That's, that's not an issue. Um, five stars. Yes, boys. Five star player straight out of the bat. That's what I'm talking about. He looks. I mean, he looks alright. But what's his report? So yeah, what's he kind of? He was operating at Campunato, which is same tier as Madeira, which is the third tier, I think. He was that club um, who had the Russian. Um, I'm sure there's a club in Portugal who had a Russian tycoon kind of thing. Liera, there we are. I've just spotted it. Are these still are these still really rich? Okay, let's let's not get carried away because we can just look at everything for for ages. Um, so let me do my responsibilities first, which. I mean, we're amateur. Well, let's have a look at the staff, actually. So, we still need two coaches. Uh, we've got no scouts. I don't think we're going to need any scouts this season. Maybe just one chief scout, possibly. Uh, I mean, I've got no coaches, and I've already got the best defence in the league. Uh, what's the season preview? I'm assuming the season preview. These are weird, right? It's, oh, it's gonna, it's, it loads all the teams, I think. Oh, no, it doesn't. Okay. Um, so, yeah, the second best player in the league is that guy. We've got the best player in the league. But it's showing you 32 teams, so we're kind of predicted high. Is this guy on an amateur contract? I think the first thing we do is... Oh, we, oh, I was going to take my opposition's best player, but it's not working. Okay. Uh, this is a really good way to find players, you know? <laughs> you can just steal the players. <laughs> oh, it's so good. Okay. Russians are expecting to sell the club. Okay, let me just get a few bits and bobs out of the way, because we're going to get carried away otherwise. Um, I don't think I can take any of these out. Let's try and negotiate. Um, no, I, I literally can't take anything out. To be honest with you, I, I'm not too fussed. I, I'm happy with that. Can I Can I not go back? I, I don't understand what I'm doing here. Okay, why can't I confirm? I'm so confused. Okay, why can't I click anything? Am I am I being stupid here? Am I am I losing my mind or is FM broke? <laughs> I don't know what I'm pressing, that's the problem. Um, you can't win the wrong league. So why can't I click anything though? Okay, I might have to restart. <laughs> okay, let me restart. I don't know what's just happened there. The game just kind of broke. <laughs> Quickest sack ever. Well, it's not letting me continue. Look, it's not letting me do anything. I can't finish. I can't go back. That's got to be a bug, right? <laughs> yeah, I literally can't can't press anything. So I'm just gonna have to restart it. If I can find FM, there we go. Okay, let me just reload. I don't know what that was. That was really strange. That's got to be a bug, yeah. Raz, we when you get stuck on contract talks, yeah, it's, it'll reload now. Mathis, can you put the link for the Discord in the chat if you don't mind? Um, there's a section on our Discord channel. Why is this game not launching? And it's got, um, yeah, it's got everything you need to know regarding the database and stuff like that. 
I mean, I just want to play FM. Why is it not loading? There we go. Fine now. The Brazilian still kind of Portuguese in the various leagues. Um, <laughs> bring your bad luck. You don't remember it's all good. The save game could not be loaded. Are you ready? Seems like that's the way FM wants me to go. Uh, Grant, how you doing, man? Okay, we're back. So I'm just going to literally accept to get that out of the way. Um, and then what we're going to do... Of course, these are the transfers. Oh, you know what I forgot to do? I forgot to put the real name fix on. Ah! Right, we're going to have to ignore that. Because Juventus are just called Zebra. Oh, dear me. I knew there was something that... Because I, I haven't started a new save since Farsley. So, I mean, it's fine. I'm not that bothered. Like, it's not a problem. Okay, um, tactics. Right, let's get loaded. The 4 2 3 1. So, this is the tactic that I might go with. I'm definitely going with AMs. We didn't really go with AMs. Um, and this, this is the other tactic I want to show you, a Vish especially. Uh, the 4 3 2 1. So, this is the other one. But I think I'm going to go with this. I've been using this for a while on other save. Uh, it's been doing all right. It's not amazing, but. <laughs> Mathis, you are a bot. Okay, I think, uh, Vish, you might like this one, to be honest. But I, I don't know yet. But we're going to get them loaded in a way for the friendlies. Talking of friendlies, we need to arrange some friendlies to get some money, I believe. Though I don't know how far we can go down. I mean, to be honest, I'm playing some decent friendlies, but I'm going to cancel them all. I want to do my own. Uh, I, I do like doing my own friendlies, to be honest. I need to do my responsibilities as well. We don't really play that many games throughout the season either, you know. Let me just cancel my friendlies. See if we can get a little bit of money into the club at least. Okay, let's uh, let's do a cup. I don't know if we're going to be able to do this. Okay, so the big clubs aren't there. I was hoping Benfica and Porto would be there, but they're not. Ah, uh, that's a shame. Okay, um, so when do we play the first game? Absolutely ages away. Something other than a 4-4-2, can't believe. Yeah, of course. Um, right, so I'm just going to get a, f a few cups, I think. Um, let's try the Saturday and the Sundays, maybe. Right, who's the biggest clubs? Who will bring the most fans? I'm going to go with probably Boa Vista. I'm going to go with... I don't think Madeira's got many fans, to be honest. Chavez and Gil Vicente, maybe. Let's try that. Okay, we're just gonna make one or two cups. I I'm not doing too much, like, and we're not gonna play the same teams. I'm just gonna make two cups just to get a little bit of money into the club. Um, because if, if you look, they get even worse. Yeah, they get even worse. These teams, and see, there's no. Okay. Might have to do it here with the larger one still there. I mean, we'll play Madeira, I think. Okay, let's go Vittoria. Okay, I'm just going to go with that, and then we'll just arrange some kind of uh, some multiple friendly matches, I think, until the first game, once a week. Um, from like here, so let's get rid of that. 
I'll right, we'll get four friendlers there. Let's go nearby teams. It's costing so much money. I want free. I need to save some money here. We're going to play some away games though. Against really bad teams. And then we'll finish with two home games. Uh, okay. We do need a lot of friendlies because of course we need to... Um, Got a long way until the season finishes. You can see, like, look how many how many weeks there is. There's so many weeks before the first game here. And we're gonna play four home games against. Um, Would ES Tunis travel to us? Maybe that might be all right. You know. Let's see if they accept. Uh, I think it says the. Yeah, okay, they won't come. But bringing ES Tunis here might be good. And then let's play some decent uh, some shit teams. Let's go with these. Okay, we've got a lot of work to do, boys. A lot of work. Okay, there's lots of friendlies. Let's do this responsibilities. You need more making money. As a, ooh, making money is an issue. Yeah, it will be. Like, I mean, I'm not too worried about the first. Um, the first season, because you've got a really good team, and you should get promoted first season easily. It's just, I, I don't know this. I don't know where you'd get like. Um, I don't know where you go pro. At what point you would go pro in, in Portugal? Like I, I'm, I'm really not sure. Because if you look at, uh, I need to go look how many. There's so many groups and stuff. You just don't know where you're at. Obviously, the Secunda League, all the teams are pro, are pro right? And it goes down to the camp at this one. And I'm pretty sure Madeira. Madeira are pro. So maybe the third tier you would go pro. And then I still don't know if we're in the fourth. So cause it looks like in the third a lot of teams. I mean, it seems a semi-pro kind of pro. Um, Yeah, so I guess we'll see. But to be honest with you, the, the, the amount of time I'm going to be streaming in the next few days will probably be in the Premier League in about four days. <laughs> so, we'll see. Um, <laughs> there's going to be so many, so many streams. So I'm bored out my, my, out my head right now. Okay, so we've just cancelled a few friendlies. Let me do my responsibilities. Cause very important, of course. Uh, let's go to board. So that's fine. Staff. Uh, I want to make sure... Nope. Nope, I do all of that. Thank you. I don't want you to piss around signing staff that I don't need. Confirm that. How about scouting? I assign my own scouts. Confirm. Transfers. No, you're not signing players. You know what I wish FM would introduce? Just literally a little, a little box right here. All it needs to say is import responsibilities. So you can save your responsibilities. So you ain't got to do this every time you start a new save. That's all it needs. Um, good choice of country. Good luck with the save, buddy. Going to follow for sure. Thank you, Nuno, man. Media. I ain't doing media. No chance. Most boring thing. Let's have a look at training. I ain't doing my training either, especially this lowdown. Uh, how about tactics? Uh, I'm not doing tactical briefings. To be honest with you, I could probably put a goalkeeper up front and then score a few goals in these leagues. Uh, if we go to match, okay, I'm, I'll do my own uh, touchline instructions. I'll do my team talks. I'm not leading friendly. I want to get rid of that. Okay, I think we're all good, to be honest. Question is, do we have under-19s? We do, okay. So we've got four players right here who seem all right. I'm just going to move them into the senior squad. Uh, we don't really need them in the under 19s, to be honest. Um, so so far so good. What next? I guess players, right? I know I put a short list. Of, I've been looking. Obviously, I've, I've announced that I'm starting this save last week. So I have put together a short list of players that's available for you guys. So it's in the Discord channel. So we're gonna have a look through some players. Um, I just don't know which formation to go with. What would you guys think? Like, what, what would you guys say? Maybe this is a chat decision. Do we go with a 4-2-3-1? Or, in fact, to make it easy, because one's 4-2-3-1, one's 4-3-2-1. One. 
Do we go with the shadow striker or do we go with the two attacking midfielders? Chat, your decision. I feel like I'm the only one here who's not Portuguese English. Where are you from, Zapod? A lot of years seem to want the Shadow Striker, to be fair. I mean, it did do well. We've, we've used this tactic once in the Wheel of Fortune. Um, okay, we're, we're going to go with a 4-2-3-1. But I, I'm going to look at this. If we do sign two amazing attacking midfielders, it might be worth looking at this. Uh, I'm going to leave it there anyway, just in case. But, you know, it's, 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 it's kind of very similar tactics. It's just the wingers are pushed up. Um, and, of course, you don't need a box-to-box. -box, and you've got already a shadow striker who's probably going to be able to play as an attacking midfielder. So, um, so yeah, let's, let's go with this. Um, let's, let's put the team together first. Let's see what we've got. Let's see what we need. Let's see what we can release. We've got a fuckload of players that's wanted. <laughs> I mean... We're going to lose players, like left, right and centre. Don't get attached to any kind of player because you are going to lose so many players. I'm probably going to sign 40 players in this transfer window just because I know I'm going to lose them in six months. Um, that's going to be it, what's going to happen until we go semi-pro. Um, but let's see what we've got for the time being. So I know we've got two lone players that we aren't going to lose. Uh, one is a goalkeeper and one is a centre mid who doesn't really play any of my roles which is kind of worrying he can play dlp but can i terminate him oh, brilliant um yeah okay i i'm gonna see what i've got first so luckily we've got jao Oliveira. is he wanted at the moment I mean, can I offer him a new contract? Okay, man, I'll give you a vice captain if you don't go anywhere else. How about that? He wants no wage. He wants no bonuses. Okay, let's finalize that deal. <laughs> does that even make a difference? <laughs> um, <laughs> I don't think it does. Okay, what we got? So we've got... Of course, we are playing with central defenders. We're not really playing with um, box uh, ball playing defenders. Sorry, so this one is a central defender tactic. Though so I'm pretty sure the last time I had this, it was ball playing defenders. But we'll we'll go with this for the time being. I'll double check. Um, but yeah, central defenders is probably going to be you know ball playing defenders as an amateur club isn't really going to work. So this is probably better to do this. Like, yeah, we'll probably will go with um, box to box uh, ball playing defenders when we get to the Premier League. But right now, I don't think we need to. Uh, and then I've got Jorgino or Jorgino, a left back. Box to box. Uh, Nuno and Enrique could probably play there. I must have a DLP. Not really. Um, yeah, you can see where the team is kind of poor. Especially attacking. And Jorginho is more of a, a left winger. Uh, and then striker. Yeah, we've got a few. So, hmm. Every time you do a contract, it'll make it start next season. Yes. Ah, okay. Yeah, that makes sense. i seen that, actually, on Luke's video on FM Scout. And I've never personally used that before, so... Okay, let's have a look at some of these players. I know Pat's the own player, people like that have been signing a few. Let's load the shortlist. This shortlist is available on the um, on the Discord. So you can find some of these players. Is it, There's just like 234 players. Uh, the, the way I've done this, by the way, is I've literally just gone into player search and used my filters. Um, but let's have a look. So... I think I'm going to go from the off here. I'm going to go with the goalkeeper first. A lot of these are foreign players. Um, can we have, maybe have a look for a sweeper keeper? Uh, just so I can show you as well. So the way I found these, um, of course, you need a package. But I need to add my filters anyway, actually. Let me just get my player filters in. So yeah, my player filters are right here. Of course, you will probably need... Yeah, we're not going to sign De Bruyne, of course. Uh, you will need to get a package, though, if you do it. You can do Portugal. 
And of course, the staff that you got, you will find other players. This is pulled from everywhere as well, so... I don't think there's any rules on foreign players at all, so... Okay, let's... I need a sweeper keeper. I don't know who to sign. Um, try to have as many Portuguese, Brazilian. Uh, yeah, I mean, because they're amateur, I can just release them. I mean, that guy's that guy's called John. I need to really get them in my team before I can only offer. I need someone with like first touch, right? Like my sweeper keeper at the minute has got one first touch. <laughs> the guy on loan from Sporting as a sweeper keeper and four throwing is pretty shit. I can't even terminate him. Um Yeah, so let me I need to find a better a better one. I'm actually tempted to just sign them all and see who fits the best. I mean, that guy's all right. Low eccentricity, good first touch, good throw. I'm going to get this guy. He's interested. Okay, star player. Boom. We're going to sign so many players. <laughs> One first touch. I know, right? And he's on loan from Sporting. Ooh. Oh, look at that Look at that eccentricity. Jeez. Uh, Farsley hasn't finished now. Uh, I can offer trials, but I can only offer. Um, if I sign them, if this shit, I can just release them. I don't need to really do trials. Um, they join straight away as well with amateurs, so we can always come back to this. I'm just going to bring three in, see what they're like. If they're crap, I'll release them. That's the beauty of amateur, right? Let's have a look at the left back, though. So. <clears throat> no way New Phil would join us, surely. Um, I would love to bring this guy in. I mean, he's interested, but is he going to join? Hey, it'd be sick. Caesar. I mean, there's some really good players. I'm probably just going to take it slow. Just sign anyone I want to sign and then come back. Um, Borges, really good. There's lots of Brazilians. Okay, let's have a look at Rybacks. Uh, okay, what we got here? Paraguayan. Ukrainian. So I do want more of a, a complete wing back, really. Alan Garcia, good crossing. Eddie Mundo is a, more of an all round player. We're going to smash the league if we bring these in. I'm trying to remove these just not to piss anybody off, really. Oh, 15 crossing, yes. <laughs> We're just signing so many random players. Um, okay, how about centre backs? Here we got quite a lot of centre backs. Um, so we are playing central defender, right? So someone like this would be fine. Are those players coming? Yes, they are. I, I've put the the database, um, uh, the shortlist on um on the Discord channel. If you guys want to, obviously, start the save as I did, and um. Yeah, you can you can just come in and and sign some of these players. There's lots and lots of good players about. Like I said, the the initial few um few seasons it can be very easy, like trust me. I mean, we say that, but it, it should be. Like I say, we've got really good rep, so for the league that we're in. Okay. Is this what you did, Patsio? 
Uh, okay, let's have a look at center mids now. I don't really recognize anybody. The problem is I don't know the roles without trialing them. So we may have to come back into this. Oh, he wants a lot of um a lot of promises. Uh all the information is in the Discord channel. Oh, Danish 20-year-old. Okay, let's get some players in, then we'll see where we're at. Danny Cox. I always see this guy all the time. I, I, I swear to God. I'm sure I mention... I'm sure I say that exact same thing every time I see him. I'm, I'm, sure, I'm sure you guys have heard me say that before, right? Or there's just a lot of people called Cox in, in Dutch. I, I don't know. But I swear I always see that guy. Okay, let's go left wing. Hey, look who it is. Oh, who's that, boys? We've got to, right? <laughs> hey, Ate. We've got to, the Farsley man. Yeah, we're going to bring Ate in. Please only use Portuguese or South American players. We, we will do. Like, but right now, I just need to get promoted. So we will we will we will use a lot of South American players. Don't worry. But yeah, I've I've got to focus on getting promotion. Otherwise, I'm screwed if I don't. Nice flair. Okay, how about the right hand side? Ricardo Campos as well. Jordan Cox. Ricardo Campos. He's yeah. We've had that guy as well, right? There's a few English players in here. Um, I do need okay. I'll bring him in. <laughs> I'm gonna have the biggest team ever. That guy can play along all the top. Let's have a look at strikers though. Now I did. There is a strike. Oh, about shadow strikers. Um, to be honest with you, I think we just bought in a few decent ones. Uh, problem is, I don't know who. I I know the shadow striker needs good finishing. That's all that I really know. Like obviously eight finishing. Oh, that guy's all right. He's got a lot of sixteens. Yeah, let's bring them in. And then striker, there was a guy, um, I put it in the chat and he was Colombian. Um, what was his name? I really, really want him. I don't know his name. I literally put it in the Discord channel earlier. Oh, there he is. Joha. Okay, he looks alright. <laughs> Okay, let's bring him in. I'm, I'm probably going to bring Campos in as well, you know, if he joins. He is one to buy a few clubs. Okay, let's continue. Let's get a few players in. And then let's see where we're at, shall we? <laughs> I love a boozer. Um, how do I get the shortlist? It's in the Discord channel. Okay, let's continue. So... What's next? I, I guess, you know, there's not much we can do. Like, we have no money, really. Um, we're not going to be able to sign all of them players. Um, so, yeah, it's, it's going to be one of them things. I haven't uploaded the tactic yet. Oh, sorry, I have. It's in the Discord channel as well. It's in the Balensis um, channel side thing. Yeah, I uploaded it for... Um, the Patsio yesterday. The 
the Discord link. Right, the Discord link is right in the chat now, so join it. Any information you need on this save. Like I said, I'm always in Discord, so if you need any help after the stream, I could always answer you. I'm a bit confused why the transfer window opens then closes the day after. <laughs> like I said, we're not going to be able to sign all of these. A lot of these are going to leave, so... We're also going to lose a lot of players. I mean, look how many we're bidding for. Who the hell are these? Oh no, we're about to... Are we about to lose our players? Yeah, we're about to lose our players. So maybe if we offer a new contract, end of season. I'll be honest with you, I don't really want to lose anyone. I hate losing players. I, I really hate losing players. Like, I'm assuming I can just kind of release these if it doesn't work, or put them in under 23s. Okay. Uh, four two three one, or three two four three two one. I can't remember. <clears throat> so, how many people's looking forward to the save? Like watching us try and get. I hate losing players. At least our winger is now a gained a Portuguese citizenship. Oh, press conferences, man. So annoying. There we go. Bosh. Can't join the survey. You should be able to. <laughs> Literally all of our players are going to... Oh, look at these already. I mean, you've took everything from us. You've demoted us to the fifth tier, and now you're trying to take Eddie Mundo from me. He's not even my player, but, you know, I'm still gone for him. I mean, <laughs> who did you join? Udinese or... Um, <laughs> or B Billy Nessus? Come on. Stealing players from me already. Right, first player's in. Mink. Good old Mink. Um, so, yeah, Mink... Has joined. Is he a shadow striker? Kind of. It's like four and a half star. <laughs> nice. So of course we've lost a few players. Um, we, we're just gonna sign whoever. See where we're at. See what we're missing. I um. Let me get the Discord link one sec. Alright, that's valid for one day. There you go. I mean, everybody, <laughs> everybody we're signing is four and a half star. Oh, this shows you how poor. <laughs> my team is yeah we should be able to smash this league if we can do this like every season until we get pro and then build our own team yeah we should smash it really hey Magia joined which is good like I say you guys it, with Portugal like the lower leagues are quite easy Um, it's yeah, it's, it's it's really strange. It's when you get to the Premier League, it's really, really tough. Like, trying to keep hold of players when you've got Chelsea, United, PSG, trying to poach all your youngsters, it's it's, it's such a good save. Um, Yeah, where about, what are they kind of, the players we're signing? Like Mink, let's have a look at his report. Um, So we operate in a, the second, third tier, which is kind of, yeah. It's kind of good, really. We honestly, we should absolutely demolish this this league. I'll be very surprised if we don't. We should get promoted. If, if I don't get promoted, I quit. <laughs> I know it's going to be easy. It's like when you start a twelfth tier English save. 
Uh, you just kind of go through the leagues really quickly. That's the third tier. Exactly, yeah, that's, that's good. Uh, if, if players are kind of getting worse now. We've still got waiting for a few more, but these are all the players that I think are being bidded for. Let's put the team together right now, though. Let's see what we've got. Okay, so we're going to go in goalkeeper. We are going to go with Yilmar. Go with him. I don't even know who this guy is. It's Colombian. Okay. On the right-hand side, uh, Magica. Centre-back, Kamara. Along, we probably could do with another good centre-back, uh, Marquez. On the left, we still need a left-back. Box-to-box, -box, Brute. The DLP, we kind of still need a DLP, to be honest. Maybe him. The right-hand side, we've got plenty of right-wingers, at least. Um... Minx has got a better name. The Shadow Striker, we probably still need a Shadow Striker, but Gabriel could probably play there. Uh, on the left, Azvedo can go there. And then Striker, I mean, that's the team. The team's done, boys, apart from the left back. You should release everyone under three stars. Yeah, we will do. I'm just bringing some players in first. Um, yeah, we'll, we'll get to that. We'll get to that. Don't worry. Like I say, today is just really to kind of introduce the save um, and, and kind of go from there, really. I mean, we've got a few friendlies we're about to play and stuff like that. Um, but yeah, I mean, like I say, I'm, I'm just really looking forward to it. I, I know how, like, if you've never managed in Portugal before and you, you're just kind of used to playing in England, I, I would definitely suggest managing in Portugal. Like, there's barely any rules. So you know how you've got Brexit... You know, you don't have to worry about Brexit. You can sign players from all over the world. It's it's amazing. Um, I did just sign another centre-back, right? Who could probably replace... Uh, Marquez, maybe? Yeah, Vignati joins. Still need a left-back, though. Get that on the list. Was there anyone on that shortlist who was a left-back? I want to import. I want to. No, I don't want to import. I want to load. See, obviously, I could load the best free transfers up, but I mean, the chances of any of these. Okay, there's a few actually. This is the one that I did on the Steam. This is on the Steam Workshop that I uploaded. So these are actually interested in joining, and I wouldn't have thought that. Really strange. So you know the the shortlist that I did for. Uh, the Wonder Kids, which is this one. So this is the one that's on the workshop that you might have seen. Um, yeah, there's even players. There's even Wonder Kids. I mean, shall I sign this Syrian 18-year-old who's a Wonder Kid? Mustafa Gamade, who's got 20 determination. <laughs> shall I just sign him? <laughs> I know he's going to be an amateur player, but... Why not? <laughs> There's a few others as well, but I'm guessing all of these. I mean, they are on youth contracts. Uh, but yeah, this is obviously the 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 uh, the players that's on that shortlist. So these are just the ones that's interested. Um. But yeah, it's always worth just just checking your shortlist. Like I I obviously keep all my short my shortlists. Um. Uh, of course, none of the English Wonder Kids would join me, I don't think. Oh, there's a few that would join me. So you can kind of see the rep. Is it 18 or Wonder Kid here? Apparently. Um, but yeah, you can kind of see the rep and stuff like that. How big this rep is. Uh, but yeah, let me look, quickly look for left backs. You can see a few of the players. So obviously we went for, uh, for Vashon, didn't we? But we went to Brighton. Uh, okay, let's have a little look. So as long as we can get one or two, I'm not really fussed who, to be honest. I'm not going to piss around signing lots and lots of free players like we've done that now. As long as we've got the, the backup 16 tackling that guy. Nice. I've already gone for him. Uh, 
Okay, I think we're good with that, to be honest. I, like I say, I'm just going to keep this whole squad. Um, and just have 10 goalkeepers. <laughs> I remember playing in the Romanian 4th tier in FM19, which is an amateur league. And then promoting to Romanian 3rd tier, which is all kind of stupid rules. I felt like dying inside. Yeah, yeah. Uh, maybe a backup for each position for depth. Yeah, maybe. Maybe. Um... Still got a few players joining, so we've got. I think we've got plenty of depth. I'm going to release all the really bad players though, um, so we'll go through them in a second because there's going to be a lot of one-star players stuff around. And then we'll see where we're at. Our players like this are perfect for backup for the season, I guess. It looks like we're getting battered though in the friendlies. We lost to Boa Vista three-one. We've just beat Gil Vicente on penalties. Are we making any money? We've got 92k in the bank. I mean, that's all right. That, that I'm happy with that, to be honest. Yeah, that's not bad at all. Sign everyone. <sighs> Sign everything that moves. <laughs> Why not? You can, right? You're not paying for them. I mean, it's just, you're just going to have a lot of people moaning. That's the problem. Uh, we just signed Kendi. I think I've offered them all star player as well. <laughs> as if we just signed. Um, come on, my, uh, my, my scout's bringing some players in for me already as well. As if I've just signed that Mustafa. He's actually on the Wonder Kid list and he's joined us. That's brilliant. He's got to be five star potential then, surely. He's terrible. One, he's getting released. I was expecting him to be really good. Seeing he was an FM Scout Wonder Kid list. Okay, we've still got a lot of players joining. Hey, we're playing Madeira right now. <laughs> that was a quick trip. All the way from Syria to Portugal. Hey, we just beat Madeira, boys. Madeira. <laughs> we did get trolled then, proper. It's funny. Maybe because your scouts are bad at judging. Eh. Okay, I, I think the team's done. I'm kind of going to have to put the team together again, though, because I don't really know. Let's have a look at the depth, shall we? Who's really, really bad in this team? Okay, so you guys... I don't think are going to cut it. Uh, I think I might release all of these. Let me just release these first. So we, we know these guys... are terrible. Okay, so they can go. I think I'm just going to save the rest just in case. Okay, so a few, a few people get released. Let's have a look at the team now. So if there's anything where maybe we've got like... I don't know. Let's have a look. So goalkeeper-wise, I mean, I don't think we need all of these goalkeepers, you know? I think... Uh, I mean, that Duarte is shite, but he's on loan. I don't know who I've just signed as well, that's the problem. I mean, I, I guess we'll just have, like, four and just get rid of Foles, maybe. Let's have four. Let's get rid of this guy. I don't want to release too many because if I do get players poached, I get in trouble. Uh, so we're going to keep four goalkeepers, just in case. Uh, Mosquera is going to be the number one. On that right-hand side, I mean, I've got two. It's okay. I maybe need a third right-back, maybe. <laughs> you probably sound the non-Portuguese ones. Yeah, maybe. Uh, centre-backs. I mean, I've got plenty of centre-backs that I'm just going to keep. I'm going to keep all of these. Um, but yeah, we've got three really good ones. So, I mean, if we've got any left-back, left-footed. Left so he's right-footed. How about Sissoko? What's he... White only. So let's maybe go like that. Unless the other guy, Kamara, is left footed. Nope. 
Either way, we've got two, three decent centre backs. Um, and then on the left, yeah, we, we've got uh, Veloyes. I probably need a left back to be fair. Still, box to box, we're gonna go with Brutes. The DLP, we're gonna go with. I mean, my midfield's really poor. Mink on the right. Or do I go Mink there? I honestly don't think it's going to make that much of a difference, to be honest. Uh, and then on the left, Asvedo. Striker. Okay. I probably need another striker, right? I've only got one good striker. Uh, the tactics in the, um, in the Discord channel, yes. Jamie Thomas. I know someone told me about Jamie Thomas. Oh, Pat's here, right? He's <laughs> still a free agent. Should I bring Jamie Thomas in, boys? Uh, we know he can score goals. Jamie Thomas is coming in. How about Ram Kilday? Let's bring a few heroes back from the Fars they save. <laughs> Let's bring Ram Kilday in as well, shall we? Why not? Okay, um, let me just quickly go for a few more. I want to go to my shortlist again. Loads. Okay, let me just bring... I want to bring another big striker in if I can. Ricardo Campos went to Milan. Jeez. Okay. Maybe an English striker. Pachu. Um, how about a Shadow Striker? A lot of these have already left now, as you can see. Still a few available. I need more of an AMC though, right? Okay, I, I don't think I'm going to sign anyone else. I think we're going to leave it. I think... Yeah, okay. I, I don't think I'm going to sign anyone else. <laughs> I was looking at him, Mathis. Alan Ruiz. Tyler Warren. I don't think Tyler Warren's, Tyler Warren's interested. I forgot his name. Is he not on the game anymore? It was Tyler Warren, right? I mean, this guy. No way is this guy interested. Surely. Are you joking? That guy cannot be interested in joining the fourth tier. No, I don't believe that. Let's try it. Oh, what? How is that guy interested? That is crazy, man. Look at the stats on that guy. Holy shit. Tyrell. Warren. Oh, he's gone to Salford. Okay. <laughs> How is that guy like? What the hell? How are you guys finding all these? I didn't even spot that guy on my shortlist. You have him as well, Patsyero? That guy is ridiculous. You'll lose him after like six months. Uh, we lost 2-0. So are we going for the minimum scoreline of 10-0? In these games, what do you reckon? <laughs> Imagine if we lose the first game. I mean, there's plenty of friendlies for my guys to get used to each other, I guess. We have had, like, a brand new team. I did the one pound non-contract on him. Yeah, I mean, it's fine. I'll offer him a new contract and just next year or something. There's going to be a lot. I'm not getting attached to any players, really. <laughs> Bit of an extra incentive to stay. Uh, so we've got a new fullback. The Renan joins. I don't know if he's as good as the other guy or if even he is a complete wingback, but... Yeah, plenty of players join him. You can see they're getting kind of worse now, though. <laughs> One pound. 
Uh, hey, Jimmy, glad to see a new stream. I've been catching up on the Farsi, but I'll make this my new series for sure. Dale, what's going on, man? The Farsi save hasn't ended. I still will be doing it, but it's always nice to, to you know, to start a series from the start. So, yeah, definitely. I'm sure people's got plenty of time to catch up at the minute. So, I think this might be... I mean, Jamie Thomas is here. Ram Kild's in. And how have we signed this guy? Alan Ruiz. I mean, like when you look at this guy's stats, you think Premier League player, right? I'm, I'm intrigued to see this guy's report, by the way. I'm really intrigued. Dale, thank you, man. Appreciate it. First member of the stream. Welcome. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Guaranteed going to go soon. That's the fun of amateur saves, though. I mean, Jamie Thomas is all right, to be fair. Oh, look at this guy. Jeez. Um, oh, what? Look at that. How did you guys find him? Good player for most Premier League sides. We're in the 4 4 I still don't know what tier we're in. No one's told me. Um... Alan Ruiz joins Billy Nasus. Uh, this isn't just me, by the way. Uh, like Other people are signing players like this. You know, you've got big rep for the league that you're in. Uh, he's got to be the best player in the league, though, right? Let's have a little look on the season preview. Yeah, he's the best player in the league. Uh, we're going to smash this league, boys. I mean, if I lose this, then something is really, really wrong. I was the only four and a half? No idea. Probably because I've got quite a big squad, maybe. <laughs> That's crazy. But yeah, let's 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 again put the team together because I mean the thing is now I've signed that guy. Is he a shadow striker as well? I mean not really, but he can play there. Okay. I mean, I, I think the team's done. I don't need to put the team together now. The, the team is done ready for the first game, so let's play that. Perfect. I have a show at Puskas. Nice. <clears throat> when do we play the first game? Glad to be a part of the FM Scout series. Yeah, it's, um, like I say, we've got lots of time, boys. I'm about to get Fabio Contrao. I, I don't think. Mm, should try it. Nah. I don't think he'll come on a on a free contract. Will Elderson? There's going to be lots of Eldersons, right? This guy, I'm assuming. You mean this guy? Oh, yeah, he put his surname, sorry. No, he's not interested either. Bruno Gallo. I mean, it's like, yeah, some of them's not really... I don't know. Amateur contracts are really weird. I mean, what kind of name is Martin LK? Like that one as well. See some really weird names. Did anyone remember the Madeira save? That that region that came through? Um, seems like your rep is massive like Barnet was in Will of Fortune. Remember signing Oliver Torres in League 1 on Amateur? Yeah, I think, it's the, I think it's that case. I mean, the rep itself is two-star. Which, for the fourth tier and at Amateur Club, I guess it's kind of high. So you can sign a lot of good players. Um... Yeah, so, like I say, the first few seasons will we'll, we'll generally be quite easy, I'm hoping. And then, obviously, when you get to the, you know, trying to get to the Premier League. Um, but, yeah, so when's the first game? <clears throat> I've still got lots and lots of friendlies, yeah. 
Uh, we should start winning all these games, trying to get some some team together, or some cohesion together, I guess. Two years ago, he was in a sporting first team. Where can I download the Portuguese low divisions? It's in the Discord channel. Discord.gg forward slash FM Scout. I've put the link in the Billy Nasus section of the Discord. Yeah, I mean, like I say, we're, I, I don't want to sign too much because we're going to lose them. That's the problem. Like, I, I'd rather just get this season out of the way, get promoted. I don't know what league we're going into, to be honest. Like, let's have a, we probably should have a look where we're going if we do win this league. The Pro National, Da AF Lisboa. Uh, I don't really know any of these teams. Sintra Football won it last time. Okay, so we are in the fourth tier. Yeah, this is the fourth tier. So we're a league below Madeira. Okay, I, I, I'm okay with that. But of course, it works in a, I'm, I'm assuming it works in a playoff system, right? As in the top two from each group that we're in. Is it just these two? So these two go into a playoffs? I'm not sure how that works. No, no, Fars is not over. I'm still going to be doing... Um, yeah, Farsley and... And... Um, Billy Nasus, don't worry. I've got plenty of time over the next few days. Uh, this one... Yeah, is... Um, is it Kova? Thanks for starting with OS Billionaires, great club. Yeah, I'm excited, man. Just want to get out of this league firstly. Um, and try and get into the third tier, I guess. Oh no, we're in the fifth tier. I'm getting so confused. We are we're in the fifth tier. Because this is the fifth. That's the fourth. That's the third. And then League 2, Premier League. Okay, yeah, we're in the fifth tier. You get promoted if you get second. There's a playoff just to know who is champion. Oh, yeah, I remember now. Yeah, I remember. Yes, Bellum Sad are a rival. Yes, they are. Look at this. Oh, I'm so excited, boys. The moment that we play this club, oof. It's going to be interesting. Imagine if we get them in the cup or something in the first or second season. Now, what's their team like as well? Have they generally got quite a good team? Show. Show. Jack, what's going on, man? But yeah, now it's about just not really bringing in any players and and really just just try and get the players I've got to work together a little bit. Maybe win a few friendlies. Um, but yeah, there's, there's, there's really <laughs> not much I can do. Uh, I mean, if that's the one again with some green links, I'm not sure what is. Alan Ruiz just scored six goals. Of course he did. It's first game for us. Diego Poyet. I don't think Poyet will join. Uh, it's Diogo, isn't it? Well, I can't find him. How do you spell his name? Is it? I thought it was... I don't know how you spell his name. It does seem to be on the save. It's retired, yeah. Yeah, 14 million that friendly. Um, <laughs> nice. 
I feel like if I watch a friendly, it's going to take about an hour. I thought it was Diogo, like D I O G O. It must have retired. Definitely not there. <clears throat> you mean the guy who's played for West Ham, right? Why are you um, like that, Vish? Are you surprised that we won 14 0? I'm winning this one 17 0. You heard it here first. 17 0, I'm going for. We are playing nearby teams, don't forget. So we're probably playing teams like in the 6th or 7th tier or something. I don't sound like a real person, Mathis. Trolling me. We'll finish 16-0 just to spite you. <laughs> Let's have a prediction, boys. What do you reckon? Whoever gets it gets like a, a gold star. Whoever predicts the next game. Of course, we're not playing it. We have just won the first friendly out of a nearby team, 14-0. See what you can predict. Why does my music keep stopping? I <laughs> can't make clips here to make fun of you. I'm more surprised, Mathis, how long you've stayed in the stream. You, you must be really bored, right? Am I the only one having an issue opening the stream on mobile? Um, 13 2, 6 1, 10 0. 13 0. I, I don't quite think it's going to be 30. I've said 17 0. Mark, how you doing, man? Have, have, have you been in the stream? I did see you, actually. You got annoyed because I wasn't doing Fars, or was you, was you joking? Mark, I'm hoping you're excited about this. Man, I can't wait. I haven't seen Miles tonight. <laughs> uh, have we just played that friendly? Oh, here we go. What are we going to get? 17 0. Come on. Come on. 17 0. Oh, 4 1. Who predicted 4 1? Mathis, really? Out of all people. Come on. Any affiliates? I, to be honest with you, I've not even gone to the board about anything. Like, I probably should ask for a senior affiliate, right? I mean, I don't think it's going to work. I mean, I should probably ask for a professional, but that's not going to work either. Uh, oh, I can ask for a B club. Ah, okay. That's one thing that we could not do with uh, Madeira. I don't really like the B team, so I'm probably never going to ask for a B team. It just annoys me too much. Like, moving them around. I don't really understand B clubs. I don't quite get it. So I'm probably not never going to have a B team. Maybe I will. I don't know. We'll see. But let's see if I can get an affiliate. I probably can't. Probably too low down. I don't really have any money. Okay, they said yes. But again, I don't think they'll find anything. Imagine if they came back with like... Um, I'm going to say... They're going to say no. Yeah, I don't think... Okay. Okay, let's see. I mean, I'll be very, very surprised if we get an affiliate. An affiliate would be amazing because I wouldn't lose the players. Um, yeah, affiliates would be great. Uh, good to see you all well after that latest Farsi stream ended that abruptly. Yeah, Felix, my internet went down. Um, 
yeah, my internet just died. <laughs> it wasn't by choice. Um, but yeah, I I'm all good. I'm all good, thank you. Hopefully you're well. Uh, is this our player? Hey, shit, anyway, that's fine. Yeah, I'm not going to ask it too much. Like, okay, boys, predictions for the next friendly game. Let's have a little bit of fun while we wait for the next for the season to start. Get your predictions in the chat right now. So we're going to get on the 14th of August if we're going to get a, a senior affiliate. When does the season start? 14th of September. Bloody hell, there's so many it's ages away. I guess we're just predicting the friendlies for a bit. Season doesn't start till September, man. Five two seven nil eight two four one five one three one five one six one five two. Oh, Uncle Sam, what did you say about... Sorry, I did see a message about um, working in a motel. Sorry, the chat was just going a little bit crazy. Yes, Farsley is still going to happen. Don't don't worry about that. I'm currently not working because of isolation and... I'm currently furloughed, the actual saying. Um, so, yeah, I've, I've got no work for like three weeks. Uh, so, so, yeah, it's kind of worrying times, really. Twenty three nil. I don't think I've ever won a game twenty three nil. I've had a few like eighteen, I think, friendlies. I could be only getting seventy five percent. Oh, I are you not from the UK? Who's getting seventy five percent? Denmark? Is it Denmark? I think it was Denmark. Hey, we've had a new sponsorship. We wasn't expecting that. Oh wow, a new one year sponsorship deal worth 145k. Nice. Um, I, I, yeah, okay. I better start, you know, I need to get some links going really. Like, why do B teams go for your players? It's so annoying. I mean, the USA, the government has mandated that businesses pay any wage. Oh, okay, nice. Yeah, we're closed till like the 14th of April. I've not even done the staff yet, to be honest, but, I mean, we've got, like... I don't think we need to, I'll be honest with you. I I really don't think I need to do any staff. 5-1. Who put 5-1? Zhao Vieira, well done. Paul, 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 well done. Unlucky Kang, 5-2, close. Uh, I drive bin lorries, so we are class as key workers, so we've got to work on a bit worrying. But we have to do what we have to do, yeah, definitely. I mean, I've got 300k in the bank. I think it's doing alright. Did ES Tunis accept a friendly, by the way? Matthias. What's going on, man? I haven't seen you. Where you been? What's the next for? Did oh, they did accept? I'm intrigued to see what. In fact, I want to see our attendances. Why is the attendance is not showing here? Um, really annoying. I mean, our attendances really aren't that bad. They're really good for this league. Really, really good. I'm actually really enjoying starting a save where my facilities are actually okay and my attendances are half decent already, you know? It makes a change. Yet we're so far down in the league compared to everybody else. It's a really weird save. 
Like, you've got really good facilities, you've got a good stadium, you've got good attendances. Yeah, you're in the fifth tier of Portugal, that amateur club. Um, yeah, it's really strange. Like I say, I'm, I'm just going to focus on kind of my team. Though it looks like my assistant is playing like really weird players. Is there any way where you can force like who you want to play? Yeah, I didn't think they'd find anybody. How do you make like your um your assistant play the team that you select in this screen? And you can do it with your holiday. Like when you go on holiday, you can press use current team. Is there any way to do it with um? With friendlies. I've never really thought about it until I've just seen that. It doesn't really say anything anywhere. If you pick them on the tactics, I, I don't think it works. I mean, I'll try it. We'll test it, see what happens. Oh, Alan Ruiz, jeez. Okay, we'll try that. If I pick the team, I'll see if he, I'll see if he goes ahead with that. Okay, boys. Now your predictions for the game against Collego, Collegio. In the chat right now. Hopefully he plays the team that I've just put out. I don't think he's been playing um, the full team. We'll have a look after the game. I'm going with 11-0. 11-0. To be honest, a lot of my players are snobbing other clubs. Which is kind of understandable. Based on our rep and stuff. It, it kind of helps, really. 61. You mean 6-1, yeah? Okay, here we go. The next friendly. And then we play ES Tunis, which is going to be quite a tricky game. I think we're going to lose that. Though they might bring a lot of fans. I'd like to think they would bring quite a few fans. Cause they are quite a big club. And they're a lot bigger than us, anyway. I know what you guys are waiting for. You're, you're literally waiting for the assignments, right? That's, that's all you guys are waiting for. Sadly, I can't do the assignments just yet. But we'll get there. I had this idea months ago, but couldn't find the download file for FM19. Hey, 6-1. I've just lost a fullback. He has literally just signed for me. Are you fucking joking me? He has literally just signed for me. How has he, lo been, how has he been signed within like a month? Hang on, where? Who? What was his name? Majika. I've just signed him. I've just signed him. Literally a month ago, and he's already leaving. What the hell? I mean, he doesn't leave till at least till December, I guess. But how annoying is that?
I've got an idea for Ruiz. Where is he? Right, can I give this guy a new contract? So at least I can use him for the season. Why does he not want to do that? How annoying. How is that even possible? One strength. <laughs> I know, right? Yeah, he's got 16 tackling. <laughs> you know, if we don't start the season soon, we're going to lose all the players we've just signed. <laughs> oh, it's going to happen. Just about to start a Madeira save. Dale, why are you not doing the Balenza save? Click on the red lock. I'll try again. Uh, where is he? It might be because I'm removing these. Yeah, that don't work. You stole my idea, just kidding, great challenge. Yeah, it's um I'm just really excited to just take them back to the Premier League to be honest. Right, predictions against ES Tunis, a big club. What do you think boys? I, I I'm gonna go for a loss, I think. I can't see us beating this. Beating this team. Right, he can go, that's fine. Oh, we're almost starting the season, to be fair. We've only got like a month left and we start the season. Oh, you have the three tiers of Portuguese League. Ah, okay. Who we had a bid for? Of trial? Nah, you're right. You win 3 1. Tunis are a good team, though, right? I don't see them in like the. Um, in the news. Haven't they got a massive stadium as well? Like a 50,000 stadium, I'm sure. Have a little look. I'm pretty sure they have. Yeah, that's 66,000. They always get really good regions. I don't know what the current team is, like the key player. Sharifa. Was he not at the World Cup? The Oros? I don't know. I don't know. Why well, have I seen Sharifa? Somewhere. I can't think where. On TV. I'm not sure. Okay, 16th of August. Another friendly now. They've got four more friendlies before we start the season. Yes, I did, Patsy. Oh, yes. Yeah, Yoris 2016. Yeah, I, I, I remember seeing him. Spyro, yeah, he's, he's decent. Yeah. Okay, let's see what we can do against ES Tunis. So many friendlies. I mean, at least going forward, we've got a long preseason, and we can like sign some players, I guess. Uh, no nil. Okay. I mean, we'll take a no nil. That's that's not bad. Uh, more possession, more shots. Yeah, we'll definitely take that. That's a good result, really. <laughs> Sorry, boy. It's a bit of a boring game. We'll get the um, we'll get the predictions in shortly for the next game. <laughs> I've just realised Tunisia wouldn't be in the Euros. <laughs> Mathis, I didn't even realise until Mathias just said. <laughs> I must have seen him in a World Cup or something. Um, Kajagod played in Norway a bit. Good to see you sign him. And it's, I'm I'm so annoyed that you're not on the save, Mathis.
Jamie does geography. I'm terrible at geography. Okay, boys, predictions in the chat for the game now against Grupo. What do you reckon? I mean, these are nearby teams, so they should be very, very bad. Mads, how you doing, man? Long time no see, indeed. Thirty-five nil. Come on, it's not gonna happen. I mean, we won the first one. Are we, are we getting any links yet between the players? I'm seeing no links right now. Come on, boys. Can you not get links in friendlies, or is it just like the league games? I mean, we don't really need to worry about the links, to be honest. I mean, the players aren't probably going to be at the club for long enough to worry about that. Um. So yeah. Okay, I remember when you're scoring in the lower leagues on my save. Is it White Oak, I think? P potentially White Oak. I mean, the tactic, they kind of get familiar with it, which is good news. They, they should be ready, the tactic, for the first game of the season, at least. Um. But yeah, there's, I mean, there's not really much I can do. Like... I don't need to work on the staff. The staff are fine until next season. Maybe the season after. We don't really need fitness coaches and stuff like that. I, why I'm amateur is just a case of kind of continuing. 4-0 uh, though. Nice. Who put 4-0? Massive. Well done. Right, we're going into September now, so we should be playing the first game very, very shortly. When's the first game? The 14th, yeah? Two friendlies left, and then we play Agurias, Agurias, Dan Muscuera. However you want to say it. Let's have a little look at their team, actually. Who is their key player? Manuel Romano. They've got no captain, they've got no vice captain. And Manuel Romano is their best player. Um, I, I can't see us losing any game this season. I, I'm, I'm not being big-headed. I'm just saying. I just cannot see us losing a game. We have to go unbeaten, surely. <laughs> Before half the team leaves. I know, right? I'm getting a few bids still. Yeah, it's gonna, this, this first game is going to be very, very interesting. I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm kind of intrigued to see how it goes, to be honest. I, I just don't really know. Like, we've got such a good team. Hell, P, what's going on? Like, I think I could actually put this team into the second tier and probably win it. That's how kind of confident I am. And it's only going to get better the longer we stay amateur. It's probably good that we're amateur, to be fair. Like, if we was pro it, we probably wouldn't be able to sign the players that we're signing. So it's almost kind of like, yeah, I, I kind of want to stay amateur as long as possible. Yes, I'm going to lose the players, but I'm also going to be able to attract a lot more better players. It's, it's really strange. We've seen it many of times before on saves. Um, Carlos, what's going on? Uh, held Socken, what's going on, man? Um, so you can see the promotion odds from the Portuguese Football Informer. We are five to one um, to win it. We should do. Or one to five. Um, I haven't played any games yet. We're just getting through the friendlies. We've got two more. Fr these two friendlies are the last two, and then we play the first game of the season. Um. 
Yeah, I mean, like, we should really get some decent regens as well, you know? Does anyone know what the, um, what, what month, or roughly, the regens are? Is it, is it still like February? I can't remember the month for Portugal. I know it's dynamic now, of course, but it's still around a certain period, right? Hey, 8-1. Kai, what's going on? Have you done some transfers already? I have, yes. We've done about 50. <laughs> I ain't going to go through them all. Um, to be honest with you, they're all very similar. Like, There's no one really stands out apart from one player, which I don't know how we've got him. But Alan Ruiz, who was fucking... Um, it was actually one of the guys in the stream who's doing the exact same save as signed him, or two of them have. Uh, but yeah, this guy joins us on, a, on an amateur contract. With unreal stats. Um, like I say, feel free to go and start the save now. You'll be able to do the exact same and bring Alan Ruiz in. Yeah, I, I don't know how he signed this guy, but <laughs> he's with us. Uh, we are, of course, going to play him as a Shadow Striker, though. Um, but yeah, he is kind of the big player, I guess. He'll be gone in six months. No way you can keep a player like that at your club. I'm not even sure how to do that myself, to be honest. Yeah, Patsio found him. Vish, are you still here? Did you see that second tactic, by the way? I'm not sure if you've seen it. I thought you would have wanted me to play that, by the way. Rather than the Shadow Striker. To be honest, I might play both. I, I don't know. I, I still can't really decide what I want to do. If I want to go 4 2 3 1 or 4 3 2 1. Um, of course, we're not going to go 4 4 2. So that is, that's, that's the Farsley save. Uh, I don't know, Mark. I've got two tactics at the minute and I can't decide between them. Um. Like, obviously one of them is the, um, yeah, so you've got the 4 2 three, one. I'm, I'm probably going to go with both, I think. Have I just lost my winger? Who is my winger? I'm sure I put a winger in. I have. <laughs> so I signed him on the 3rd of July. And he's just gone and joined Destroyers on the 29th of August. Like, you have literally just, you've been here a month. Can I sign you back? I can't even sign him back. He's gone on 1.1k a week as well. How annoying. Oh, look at this is what, this is what happens when you're amateur boys. <laughs> Minus one loyalty. I know, right? See, so, I mean, we've got obviously some choice, so we're not in a, you know... It's just, if that's going to happen throughout the entire season, that's the problem. We've already got a link between Ruiz and Spyro, though, which is brilliant. But yeah, the other tactic is this. Um, I, I'm kind of intrigued. I, I kind of want to give it a go at some point. It's definitely going to make an appearance on on this on this series. Don't you worry about that. I do like the idea of having kind of two AMs. Uh, midfield looks very weak, but I've been using it offline and it works really, really well. Like that, look at that, it looks so good. You know? But the inverted wingbacks massively help the wingers. The wingers are quite deep, of course, even though they're on attack, but yeah, I mean, that, that is a really good tactic, especially attacking wise. But it does use ball playing defenders and inverted wing backs, which are hard to find. So we could do it, but I think for the lower leagues, we're just going to kind of stick with. Um, yeah, we're going to stick with this for the time being, I think. Um, yeah, I I'm not sure. It's going to make an appearance at some point, definitely. Shadow yeah, Shadow Strikers, same with me. 
They don't seem to perform very well at all. I, I really want to try the... I might play the first game with the two attacking midfielders and see what happens. Um, yeah, maybe. We'll see. Try to offer another contract when they get poached. Yeah, I need to fo I need to look at the news feed really. But when the clubs are offering money, uh, players like that, I'm not too fussed about losing. You know, uh, we're gonna have to sign players throughout the entire season. Really, um, we we know this. Like at the minute, we've got a sufficient kind of depth. I guess you know we've got a lot of players. Look, there's a lot of players here, so. At the minute, I'm not too worried. Oh, first game of the season, boys and girls. Here we go, very, very shortly. I just want to make sure I don't lose one of my players that I've signed. Hey, Colombo wants to leave. Yeah, he, can, he ain't coming here. I'm selling him out for free. He is not coming to this club ever again. On any of my saves. I think with the two AMs, you'll get dominated midfield. Um, I, I don't think we will. I've been using it on, on my offline save. That I'm just generally playing here and there for the last few months. And it's, it's done absolutely fine. Like, honestly, you'll be very, very surprised how the midfield doesn't get dominated. It looks like they will with just a DLP and no kind of box to box to hold the middle. Wait, it's really weird. <coughs> I might have to play it to show you. At least the first game. The thing is, it's so hard to judge. At this level, I think we can win with anything. Um, it's, yeah, it's, it's just really hard to judge. At the minute. Because our, our team is so good, they can almost play anything and still win, I guess. You have no place for the roles. I do. I mean, it's just the winger, right? Who are you managing on the offline save? Um, Olympiakos. Yeah, I'm doing a Greek save. I'm in mean, like two or three, two, three years in, I think. I've just been doing it since the beta. Alan Rose is one of the worst players to ever use a sporting shirt. <laughs> Alright, he can leave. So can he, okay. Invo inverted. Uh, I mean, they can. I, I think they can fill it, like... The ball playing defender, they can almost play it. I, I, I'm not... Chat, I, need, I don't know what to do. <laughs> do I go with the 2 AMs, or do I just stick with the 4 2 three, one? Uh, I mean, we can play both, I guess, but it's... Yeah. I don't know. I mean, they can look, they can still fill the roles quite well. Okay, I, I'm going to go with this. For the, f for the first game at least. I just want to show you how it doesn't get dominated in midfield. It's so hard. When you have like a few tactics and you don't know what to play, it's one of my hardest things to decide. So I generally stick with like one tactic through the entire entire save. Very rarely change it. But we play the first game right now of the season. Oh, what do you reckon, boys? Predictions in the chat. First game of the save of the series. I'm excited. I'm nervous. We make our debut. Oh, easy wins predicted, apparently. Um, yeah, I just don't know what to expect. We should really... We should dominate. Like, I keep saying that. We We shouldn't really get... Anything wrong with us this season? We should have get the promotion. But let's see what the two attacking midfielders can do. 
Let's see foreigners playing with the Portuguese teams. I mean, to be fair, it's Portugal's fault, really. There's no rules. What are you doing, man? There's, there's no rules. Like, most of the Portuguese teams are foreign players. You need to get some rules in your league, man. Okay, I I'm going to go with this. Uh, let's quick pick for the time being. Let's see. I mean, it's pretty much the same team. Oh, that attack, though. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. Got about a million subs and a million players off the sub bench, but that's fine. I'm going to go with this. Let's see what happens. I'm predicted first out of both groups. Okay, let's um let's see what happens and let's see what the, the two attacking midfielders can do, shall we? First game. I'm assuming all the oh wow I can't do this, hang on. We are sideline, right? There we go. Yeah, it's kind of okay. Oh, we are blue, yeah? <laughs> Offside. Oh, it's, we're, we're going to... We we have to batter these, honestly. I know everyone says it's the tree of death. Am I not playing... Um, Who am I playing up front? I don't even know who I'm playing up front. What had the Colombian? It seems to... I need to go a bit closer. There we go. How do you manage so many players? Because we're we're at we can offer amateur contracts, so lots and lots of players are willing to join you. And it's one nil. Sissoko, the centre back with the goal, move the camera up. That is what I normally have, right? I can't remember what I normally have. I, I'm pretty sure that's roughly what I have. Okay, it's 2-0. Um, I haven't. Hugo, Hugo, no. I didn't even see that goal. I think it's like this. This is fine. Um, I, I think we're, we're going to break some records this season. <laughs> um... Yeah, I, I, I can't see us losing a game this season, honestly. Patsio, how have you got on with your games? Surely you're dominating like this. Have you started your season yet, Patsio? Or is anyone who's doing the safe start of the season yet? Because I'd be surprised even if we concede. Which we, we probably will. It might be a good opportunity to do the uh, the achievement, the 20... 20 clean sheets, maybe. That's a great goal. Oh, yeah, I'll have a look at that, Hugo, definitely. Does anyone else think a goal that hits the bar first is a better goal? It's a great goal. Yeah, they haven't, they haven't even had a shot. <laughs> uh, the centre mid, they said, this is the guy who, look how much he's involved, and you're saying I'm going to get dominated in midfields. Like, he's so involved. I know we're playing, it's, it's so hard to judge a tactic at this level when we've got, like, yeah, when we've got such a good team compared to the rest. I mean, this Alan guy, Alan Ruiz, is, he's had two shots now and they've both been terrible. But yeah, they've not had a single shot. With that team, you could play 10 strikers and you will still win. Exactly, so... I mean, I, I guess we'll see what happens. Like, release him. Oh, they've got a highlight, boys. Sissoko just like... I don't know what Sissoko did there. Here we go. Ruiz. Ruiz. Is he going all the way? Where's he going? Ate. Ruiz. And there we go. 
It's 4-0. <laughs> I don't think they've been in my half apart from the highlight. <laughs> Let's make a sub now. I think we need to bring this guy on. I think every game is going to be like this this season. Um, I can say this is what happens when you when you, well, like we knew this was going to happen. You take over a club who's got two star rep, amazing facilities, kind of a big budget if that makes sense, and in the fifth tier of Portugal. I don't know what they're doing like in real life at the moment, but yeah, I I'd like to assume that they're doing well in real life in the fifth tier. Magica, Ruiz, Ate. Twenty-eight shots though we've had. 28 shots. Okay, we'll take it. A 4-0 win. I'm going for the clean sheet record, boys. Not a single goal conceded the entire season. Can we do it? Oh, I bet we're not in any cups this season either, right? Are we in any kind of cups at all? Uh, we're in this, but I don't know what this is. We're not in the um, the FA Cup or the Carling Cup. They set like the, the kind of two things. Uh, was that away or that? So that was away. So the ads. <laughs> so we took a thousand away fans to that game. Um, yeah, we had four hundred and fifty. So we've got like we're gonna get money from it, like the attendances and stuff. We should get like a, a good amount of money. But on that note, boys and girls, I'm going to leave it there. I do want to obviously do a bit longer stream tomorrow. Um, today was just going to be an intro save, like just to get you used to it and, and kind of tell you what it's all about. I hope you've enjoyed it anyway. Um, I've enjoyed it. I'll be back tomorrow. We will be doing this save tomorrow. The stream will be at 3 p.m. tomorrow. So 3 p.m., not 6 p.m. The streams are going to be at 3 p.m. going forward just so I can stream later and longer. Um, so yeah, hopefully you guys can join us tomorrow, 3pm. And yeah, it's been a pleasure. And I will see you all tomorrow. And we'll probably get the season done tomorrow, to be fair. Um, it's going to be a long stream, so I've got nothing else to do. But yeah, I'll see you all next time. Goodbye, everybody. Don't forget to join the Discord channel. Discord.gg forward slash FM Scout. And yeah, I'll see you all next time. Goodbye.